All right, good morning. Um, Tuesday, T-Mobile Tuesday, I um, dropped off that coil uh, early this morning. I just came from there. It was like four miles up the road, literally. And uh, so I was pretty happy when I found this one. That was only four miles going back to Maine. So that's good. Uh, um, rarely do I ever come across loads that that uh, that close together. So it's always awesome to find that. But um, so now we are here picking up barricades, something like that. Light load, 25 feet, only like 7,000 pounds. So that um, my appointment is for 12, but uh, hopefully they can load me here. I already checked in or whatever, but. Me and my buddy are going to do this deck over, man, because this thing is just atrocious. I replaced a few boards, which I did a video, but I never posted it. But, um, yeah, I was getting loaded, and it was like a big dumpster, roll-off dumpster. It was like 14,000 pounds, and they broke. Like, it just, it really wasn't their fault. I mean, it kind of was the way they loaded it, but it's my fault too because my boards are just old and brittle and they need to get replaced pronto <laughs> so i will be doing that in the next couple weeks doing some flooring at home too and the uh dining room that's gonna be fun so picking this load up going to augusta maine they closed the garage door so i don't know what they're doing they said wait out there till 12 no <laughs> no no i hope not because uh that would suck <laughs> But, uh, yeah, I'm going to wait and see what these guys are going to do. All right. <clears throat> check my strap. Oh, see that? Mm-hmm. That's why you check, man, because you never know if you forget one, which sometimes I do. Sometimes I'm pretty good about it. But this is uh, fencing um, going up to Augusta, Maine. That's going to fly off. <laughs> So, yeah, a little bit of fencing. It's pretty cool how they don't have, uh, like, fencing companies around Augusta, Maine to be able to get it from there. But, hey, I'm not complaining because that's how I make money, right? So let me fix these straps, and we'll be on our way to the Casa. Probably barbecue today, man. It's like 60 outside. My wife's favorite place. All right, this is probably my best tarp job yet. <laughs> Only took me an hour. But uh, so this is the one I dropped that load off earlier in Augusta. Simple and smooth. And picked this one up right near my house. 20 minutes from my house in Lawrence, Mass. I've done this load. I don't know if I posted the video. I think I did, but posted this load same stuff like military generator looking things and the hardware for it but uh yeah nice tarp job nice tarp job and uh ready to go home and eat something good eat some hot food wash my hands take a shower and relax it's going to vermont tomorrow morning and that's the way the cookie crumbles man that's it I got my sidekick with me. I let her out for a little bit because uh, I don't know. I feel kind of bad, man. Big dog in that little in that back seat, man. You know. So I let her out, and nobody was here behind us, or nobody was around us. So they're all inside. Who's that, Gina? <laughs> she don't know what to do. She she don't know how to turn around in that little space. All right, I am out of here. Let's go. What's going on? Good morning. Good morning. God bless you guys. Uh, I am headed to, uh, let's see, I dropped that load in uh, Vermont. Headed to, which that video, I didn't even do that one. I, I didn't even do a video for that one. But I waited there yesterday, stuck around, because I saw something that was paying very well going down to Maryland. So... I waited till this morning, picked it up, and now we're headed down there. And then um, I called on this one coming up to Maine. 
uh, it's paying very well as well, like 350 a mile. So I'll, I'm trying to get up to Maine by Friday because uh, the other this broker lady that I work with, uh, she had a separate load aside from the one I'm doing for her on Monday um, that was going to Vermont. So that would work out perfect because I would go pick that up Friday, you know. So go to Maryland, pick that up down there, going to Maine, and then pick hers up in Maine, and then go to Vermont, and then do her other load that I'm already scheduled to do on Monday. So that will work out perfectly, but um, got to just kind of fit all the pieces together and see what you can do, you know? But this load I got now, I'll uh, show you guys after. Um, it's a load of like stone. They're in like pallets or whatever. I've been there before. Uh, light load, not that much. It's only like 11,000. So that's good. Um, so not too, too much weight. I found a, a mud flap um, fuel station down there that's like 583, which is good because all the other ones are over six dollars the one i just stopped at in springfield in my hood <laughs> um was like 6008 or something like that so that's good uh, i've seen you know 630 650 six man just ridiculous so that's what we're doing we're gonna keep rolling down the road i got like five hours until i get there i'm gonna stop at uh my trusty wally world parking lot and uh spend the night all right good morning god bless everybody we are in pennsylvania i dropped off that little man i should have recorded it yesterday and this morning i said i was gonna take a picture but i didn't it was just a bunch of like granite nice granite uh, pieces or whatever but whatever dropped it off this morning in maryland drove up about an hour to pennsylvania and now we are getting uh i don't know what they are but you'll see i guess <laughs> some kind of um like uh some kind of uh metal pieces or whatever not high at all which is good because i have to tarp this but they're um just long so full length of the trailer pretty much like 30 something feet so that's good.
All right. Good morning. Good morning. God bless. I dropped off uh, that load of tubing this morning in Vermont, and then I drove about an hour into more more in Vermont, and uh, here we are. Gonna get these up and loaded. Can't really see, man, the sun. But these are the hot tubs here. One, two. They look big, but they only weigh about 3,500 pounds each. So that's good. Guys getting a crane ready. Watch those power lines there. <laughs> it is gorgeous out here, man. Gotta tarp these bad boys. But shouldn't be too bad. And, uh, yeah. 